today's first pitch is a fastball strike. All right down it for the Angels. How about that fastball strikes. So they're going out and they're being aggressive. High fastball lays off. And total bases. Swing and a miss. He's down swinging for out number one. Swings at the fastball and fouls it back out of play. The man at the plate has 55 infield singles. Oh boy, isn't that something? He's tied with Tim Anderson for the most and for the most since 19. Guys that swing and miss, they love to pitch to. Pop back out of play. Count stays 0-2. Austin head. He can't wait. Here's the 0-2. Wow. Yeah, he had, he needed the glove to go the other way. Blooped toward right center. And Zimmer is there in plenty of time. Two down. Really like. There is Justin Upton. Did not play last night. And a swing and a miss at a good fastball. Down in the zone. For strike one. In his zone, he can take it deep. But at this stage in his career, obviously, more than a. Swing and a miss. How's that for an opening act? Strikes out a pair for the Angels. And a weak ground ball to short. Ahmed Rosario handles it and throws it out one down. Six. Since the All Star break, just 253. And there are a number of the Angels hitters who had really good first halves in the second half. Slump, slump. Really pretty good, though. Their starting pitching has been good for them. Joe Madden had a really good quote about that, and it, it applies to the Indians, too. He said, you know, you have these moments the same time you're looking to the future, so it's fun to watch a guy like Brandon Marsh, and David Fletcher, and some of these young players and, and dream about what we might have when it all comes together. Right. So obviously you'd like it all to be working right now, but... I mean, you put him in that lineup, and it just makes it a special, uh, you know... Still no timetable for him to start a rehab assignment and what's also if at this point I think they're going to DH and we're not playing him. Well that's fine. Right right field Zimmer. But Arch you can speak to this I think just like we talk about with Shane Bieber and Aaron Savali by the way Savali will pitch for Akron tomorrow. That's great news. That is great news but I think for just to go out there. Jose Iglesias 0 for 4 last night looks at a pitch down low and that's essentially what Joe Madden said he said look let's wait on it right you can't play they got some bigger words. you're not kidding back out of play. left field pretty deep Mercado back makes the play the Angels go 1 2 3 to scoreless frame. Play by Brandon Marshall for three. And a swing and a miss. It's one and two. Got him looking. Beautiful fastball. I mean, that was right down Ontario's. He's at five already, 502 counts. Joe Adele, big swing and a miss. Pop back out of play. Let's play the hypothetical game for combined 20 starts, 10 each. In those 20 games, you bring the two vets back, or the first two guys in your rotation. Down goes Adele. Adele. It could be outstanding. You talk about consistency. It's a treat. There were times last year we were blown away by how. How well he pitched at such a young age with the, in the solar plexus a yeah, few times. It's okay. He was wobbled a bit. That's yeah, okay. You have to love the way he's come back. I'm through spots and he's doing it. Wow, well, got a piece of it. Mayfield stays alive. I mean, think about this. He's now thrown 33 pitches and 28 of those 33 are strikes. So it's only and that snaps a string of 10 cons.
Now the 2-2. He went. No! No! They said he did not go, and I do not believe it. Out of play. Jack Mayfield. That's hit pretty well. Deep center field, and it is going to be off the wall. Played perfectly by Miles Straw. But it's a two-out double for Jack Mayfield, who got the extra strike and takes advantage. Yeah, he's... And the fastball dips low. You know, here's a situation, situation, you know, with McKenzie. Pitch foul back out of play, Otani. And McKenzie again ready. The one, two. It swung on and missed. Down and in with a nasty curveball to strike him out. Now those are pretty good hitters. The, the top five of putting the barrel of the bat on the baseball. Surprised El Tuve isn't up there. He's pretty good at it. Slide to right his first time up. Popped out a play on the right side. I told you, gentlemen, about the Little League team that David Fletcher and Austin Hedges this year was on that team. How'd they lose? <laughs> well, they didn't lose much. Michael Lorenzen was on that team. Wow. And then a young kid from Los Angeles. Holy cow. That's some kind of team. Center field, strong. Piece of cake. I love the way that Miles Straw plays. Great. He didn't call the one that uh, Mayfield got the hit. He went. Well, the Indians young pitchers. As Upton pops one up. He said, Sam Hanches was good. But he said, man, that second kid, Stefan, he threw the ball really well. The year, and boy, you hope he can do that the rest of the year. I mean, not be perfect by all means, but go out and. Attack the zone, be aggressive, throw strikes. He was very good last night. Get consistent doing that. Right. Good pitch. Oh, man. He, but in the past, he said he would have been caught up in it and thought about it all week. That's hit well. Bradley Zimmer on the dead run makes a sliding catch to retire the side in order. One. Max Stassi leads off the fifth inning for the Angels. And a breaking ball misses outside. Weak ground ball to second. And Ernie Clement throws him out. One down. And he's got a nice slider. He throws to the right-handers. That put it in play. Easy outs. Zimmer calls off Ernie Clement two down. Well, twelve thousand five hundred to the plate. Tristan seven outs on three pitches or less. So easy. Half dozen. 50.com. Starting point now $12,211. Joe Adele takes a strike. Adele hit a go ahead grand slam in the no well as he went up and got that fastball and hit it out. Well, if, it, well, if it's a young man, he's a, he's a you know, high prospect. And, they're expecting him uh, to be the number one guy coming up here. Out. His helmet was flying off. He looked like he was landing on his heels. Ahmed Rosario turns it over and just in the nick of time to get him one away. And as I said earlier, it is Angels debut on April 12th. He was waived on April 27th, picked up by Seattle. Played 11 games. 
you know, at third base, he went on the IL and been out for a while, so they needed help back at that position. The one two. Don't know how serious the, the injury to Anthony Rendon is, but boy, anytime you're talking about a hip. So you said hip, we, we saw it with Chapman with Oakland. In foul ground. Two away. And here's a word from Levin Furniture. National League. Right. And you've got to play him in a position. He goes, I don't think you would see the same kind of numbers on both sides of the ball that he's putting up because he said <laughs> it shows. Beautiful Good. pitch. Pitch, a low dart away. You're gonna go back with the hook down and in. They're gonna elevate it. Okay. Elevate the heater in. I like it. Swing That's it. and a miss. He got him again with that breaking ball. Down and in. Seven strikeouts for Tristan Mc Fletcher 0 for 2 leads it off. So Cy Young's 24 consecutive hitless inning streak was in the dead ball era. So the best in modern era baseball is Dennis Eckersley. Is Dennis Eckersley of the Indians. Right. And you were behind him for some of that. 21 consecutive hitless innings started on May 25th. When went 16 consecutive hitless innings. As a line drive goes into left field and a base hit wow. by Fletcher to lead off this seventh inning. He got on top of that one. In 1973. Wow. So five guys with 16. Little tapper back to Tristan. Just one. He oh. goes to second. They get the force and almost wow. turned a double play. <laughs> a lot closer than I thought it was going to be. Made a nice sliding catch to take a hit away from him in the fourth. Talked last night about Jared Wall. Yeah, he was having a tremendous first half. Just a tad low. Center field, Miles Straw. Making the catch two down. Well, Tristan McKenzie has seven strikeouts. This high fastball. He's locating the fastball down. It seems like he's throwing strikes at will. He's had a number of. You know, it, it's like what pitch do you want to hit off of if you're a hitter going up there? And, and you see what Fletcher did. He, he got the second hit of the ball game and he got on top of him. A little slider there to take him off. That's that third at the slider. And don't don't think that the umpires can't get fooled with pitches. That slider backed up a little bit up in the zone. He swings through it. It's two and two, and I suppose you also learn. Oh, buckle him! Another wicked curve. His eighth strikeout of the day. Seven shutout frames for. St Jose Iglesias leading off. And that is a foul ball. That's a right. situation in a, in a week. In the last couple of starts. <laughs> I thought what was impressive was the last inning where he had to go in the street. You know, last yeah. time, and it's only been twice here. Too tall. Yank foul. Just a bit outside. And that's the first walk issued by McKenzie here.